I thought come dying. The doctor gave you medicine to flush the heroin out of your system. The chills are a sign it's working. Please stay and talk to me. What do you want to talk about? How sunny. Why don't you try to rest? How is he? No, I can't really speak for him. Well, how does his life seem? What do you want to know? What happened between him and Carly? They got divorced, which is the best thing for both of them. And Carly moved on. What about Sonny? Why do you want to hear all this? I mean, you've moved on. You've made a life without Sonny. What's the matter who he's been? Because it'll help me to know that he's happy. It'll help me to move on. And I need to know if someone else has ever made him happy. Well, he's had a lot of girlfriends. I don't care about that. Has he ever been in love? He says that he was. What does that mean? I, I don't know. It's none of my business, Brenda. Can't say it, can you? Say what? That someone else has made him happy. Why don't you get some rest? Does he ever talk about me? To you? I don't know. Yeah, you know. He used to, yeah. What he used to say? He said that he would die remembering your face. that Robin and I are going to be in Africa at the same exact time. I guess it was inevitable. What? Well, I knew I was going to have to face Sonny again someday, and I just wasn't ready to do it. And then there's Robin handing me his email. And then Murphy proposes to me right after that, and all I could think about was the night that Sonny asked me to marry him and how I felt. Alive, I felt and happy and excited, and and then there it was again when I just saw Sonny. I felt the same way. He didn't tell you he saw me, really. He didn't tell me. And he saved me. And pulled a gun on those two guys. Timing was amazing. It was like a dream. You ever think about the fact that Sonny actually sent you on my wedding day to tell me that he wasn't going to marry me? <laughs> yeah, I do. That was tough. But I know Sonny did it to protect you. Oh, right. Well, you could have mentioned it that day. You could have mentioned that to me. Look, I, I, I know the reasons why Sonny and I don't work. I mean, I understand, you know, the dynamic between us. But he, he could have tried harder. I mean, there was that one moment in our relationship that he could have pushed through, and he just didn't. You know you were there. What do you think? I think you and Sonny don't seem to make each other happy for very long. <laughs> I guess that sums it up, doesn't it? Sorry. I you hate it when I make you speak, you know, talk about stuff. That's why it was such a nightmare to be married to me, right? <laughs> Because I talk and I cry and I love and I laugh because I'm alive. But are you, are you happy? Are you? Well, I'm happy that I've been able to accomplish the things that I've been able to accomplish. I'm happy that I've been able to help kids who can't help themselves. I'm okay, happy I know about that. that. I know that your work is important to you. It's not safe here. And until the situation is taken care of, you're coming back to Port Charles with me.